Hey everyone, in this quick video I'm going to show you how you can back up your content when you get a new computer, as well as export tag data and developer packs to create backup copies. Let's start off by reviewing the content that we want to back up, which is all contained in the cell pack folders I've defined. We can click on Show in Explorer to find where they are installed locally. You'll want to proceed to copy everything and back up to an external hard drive and or cloud drive. In the new computer, Open up the settings panel and then add the folder where you backed everything up. Next, let's look at how to import and export specific tags. In this case, we have three separate tags named bread, food, and lady. I'll expand the menu button, select export data, and then select export tags. You'll be prompted to ensure that the custom assets are stored in the folder set in your settings which we just defined. This is because the tag data is based on the folder name, so if there's an inconsistency in the folder names, then the tags will fail to transfer properly. I'll go double check the folder name, and then proceed to export the tags. You can then see here that the tag data files have been exported just fine. On your new computer, make sure that you set the content folder first and then select it in the content manager to complete the syncing. You can then proceed to import the tag data from the defined tag folder structure. Okay, next let's quickly look at how to import and export packs for the developers out there who may want to back them up. It's really simple to do. First, start off by accessing the Packager panel from the drop-down menu on your original PC. If you need to learn more about how to package your assets into sellable content packs, please check out that specific tutorial. Here I already have a pack that has been set up, and I can browse through the various folders to ensure everything is where it should be. From there, you can simply right-click in a blank space in the Packager and select Export Custom Packs. You can also do this from the Content Manager drop-down menu and select Export Custom Packs, or by right-clicking on the actual pack thumbnail in the Packager and selecting Export Data, which will naturally only export the selected pack. Your pack may link to external files such as videos, which are not supported in this process, and you'll need to relink them manually. You can find out more information about this in a separate tutorial. Once the export is complete, you can see them organized according to the Content Manager folder structure. Finally, to import them to your new PC, select Import Custom Packs from the Content Manager drop-down menu, and you can decide where you want to import the files to. I'll choose the Project Target Library, and then select the folder where I backed up everything from my previous PC to. And that's all there is to it. The folder structures have been successfully transferred over in both the Packager and the Custom tab of your Content Manager. Thanks for watching guys, and be sure to check out our Reillusion Courses page for tutorials on other useful topics. I'll see you in the next video.